In this video, I'm going to talk about when to separate the hands on the forehand. In, in this particular video, we're going to talk about actually holding on to the racket a lot longer. Now, this is the ideal situation if you're able to prepare early enough on your forehand. So the key is that when you make your first move like this, you are going to keep your offhand on the racket as long as possible. And that is just going to help you stock the ball longer and make the necessary adjustments. Now in another video, we're going to talk about the reasons why you would want to separate sooner. But in this video, I'm going to show you if you can, if you don't feel late and you feel good on your forehand, you are going to go ahead and stock that ball and keep that, that hand on the racket and you will separate when you get ready to start your backswing into your forward swing. So you can see that I basically held this position as long as I could before I went into my backswing, which moves naturally into my forward swing. And that is when you're going to hold the racket a lot longer when you are making that first move.